Hey, we're back. This is Jonathan Katz, the guy who likes to say, Hey, we're back. I don't get it either. I'm a guy who needs an audience, and last night I went out looking for one. You know, this is starting to seem like a really stupid idea. I, I've never even met this person. So, but... I don't, think, I don't think I can turn back now, though. I'm in. Hi, I'm, J- I'm Jonathan Katz. I'm your, I'm your neighbor. You know, I used to do uh, stand-up in clubs. Uh-huh. And, and, I, and I just miss performing so much. Oh. And I saw the cars parked out here, and I'm wondering if there's any chance I could do a few a few minutes of uh, comedy for these people. What, what do you mean? So I, I told her what I mean, that we just get all the people together in one spot, and I would, uh, I would tell some jokes. And I couldn't promise that it was uh, going to be well-received. This is her dad's 80th birthday party. It's it's an older audience. Uh, I'm not always able to tune into the audience to what they're like immediately, but I, I would give it my best shot. So, hey, th- thank you again. This was so much fun. Oh, well, Jonathan, that was really kind of fun. You know, I, I, I'm i sure, I think they all enjoyed it, and what they a surprise for, a, for my father. I appreciate it. You know, it's always good to have oxygen around in a situation like that. Right. Um... No, we know, but I think no. That he looked like he was really laughing. Yeah. I, um, hey, let me before I forget. Uh, and this is awkward. Yeah. Because I generally don't charge for these kind of things. Oh, right. This is like a but. Yeah. I've been doing comedy for so long. I'm uh, not really comfortable giving it away. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, but you just came to the door and offered to do it. And you, but you asked me, so I, I wasn't sure whether, you know, you oh, wanted no, to no, pay no, me no, to... Oh, no, 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 I don't, I don't think... Do, were you looking I, for I me to pay you? I mean, no, this I is really I embarrassing. I wasn't uh, up front of it. Oh. We've seen each other two times since then, but we still haven't made eye contact. You know, I've been in and out of therapy all my life, and at this point I'm ready to try anything... Well, today it's this. It's a new kind of uh, computerized therapy. So uh, my wife thinks that I spend too much time alone, and and I, I she she might be right. I don't know. I'm not sure. Jonathan, being able to be happy when you are alone is important. Yeah. Well, I I am able to be happy when I'm alone. It's. Do you think you spend too much time alone? No, I I don't think I do. Being able to be happy when you are alone is important. Yeah, I I am able to be happy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm able to be happy when I'm alone. Do you think you spend too much time alone? I, I don't think I do. I think I spend just the right amount of time alone. My wife might argue that I spend too much time alone and that it it's that that's the reason that I'm so uncomfortable so uncomfortable in groups of people. Being able to be happy when you are alone is important. So what you're saying is it's important I think that worked pretty well for the first time. I I would try that again. Hey, before I move on, I wanted to introduce you to a guy who's who's recently divorced and is returning to the dating scene with no real skills. And then what category did you want to place this ad under? Male seeking female. Okay. First of all, did you did you want to have a headline maybe? Sad man wants to be glad man. Sad man wants to be would fit. That, that's all that fits in your 20 characters. Would you call an ad that said sad man wants to be? Probably not. So like sad wants to be glad? Yes. Yeah, that just fits. Okay. What did you want the rest of it to say? I am a semi-retired ping pong player. I used to do exhibitions okay. and play in tournaments. So semi-retired ping pong player. And then what? I'm riddled. I'm riddled with psoriasis. Not sure if you necessarily would like put that in your ad, though. That might not. I collect old calculators. Okay. I love animals, especially otters. Okay. Right now, I have for your ad. I have dad wants to be glad. Then I have semi-retired ping pong player with psoriasis, fifty-six, five foot seven, hundred and fifty-six pounds. Enjoys bus rides, collecting old calculators, 
loves animals. That close to what you want? Uh, you know, it, so it sounds good. I okay. Hey, today we heard the voice of Ren Ross. We saw the animation of Lindy Bazil. Today's episode was produced by Katie Covet. Music for today's show was written and recorded by Jonathan Katz. I also want to, do a, to thank the Frank Wilkins Band and uh, WGBH. I'm Jonathan Katz, and you've been watching WKATZ. Also on the web at WKATZ.com. And thank you so much for watching.